I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Happy Friday, it's March 5th, 2023, and we have so much going on here on this Friday. Um, let's start off, Coach G, a special guest, and some hey, volleyball buddy. players. Yeah, we got some volleyball players Tell here. Tell what happened yesterday at Avondale. Go ahead, Coach G. All right, so the seven squad played their hearts out last night on the road against a tough, scrappy Avondale opponent and emerged with a victory. Hey. Three sets to one. Avondale came out with an early lead in set one, but as we like to say, Walter found its level quickly with Baker taking the set 21 to 9. Maddie McChester made numerous defensive plays along with surf streaks from Casella Marco and Emily Gill. Took control of set two, riding seven and four point surf streaks, leading Baker to a 21 10 win. Bobcats lost their focus though in set three, losing 21 to 13, but played together as one team with resiliency to edge out the Mustangs 21 18 in an ultra intense set four, sealing the win. The Baker Tough Awards for the game the team first award goes to Kamora, outstanding character goes to Caitlin, you never give up goes to Ileana, you get better every day goes to Maddie, and the hard award goes to Arkita. It was a great game, and I'm going to pass it over to Dom for the eighth grade update. Oh, I need your autograph skills too after the show. Thank you. <laughs> um, the eighth grade Bobcats tied with Avondale on Thursday at the away game. Uh, they were able to take the second set, finish strong by getting the full set too. All right, so seventh grade one, eighth grade split. Uh, good job. They have a game today after school um, against Florida. Uh, hopefully the snow holds off um, and they don't postpone it again. Uh, that is a threat. There's a lot of snow coming. You guys are there, right? Yep. Uh, but what else is going on? Uh, March is reading month. Let's start with that. Yes. So every Wednesday this month, there will be a drawing for a $20 Barnes & Noble gift. Every time you finish your book this month, scan the QR code in your ELA teacher's room to be entered in the, in the raffle. Okay, so yeah, so we'll show the QR code here. Uh, we also have um, a teacher book selfie of, of the day, every day. And um, you see this is Miss Butch today and her daughter, and you see what they're reading. So uh, share your reading selfies. Uh, email them to Mr. Gwen, and we'll post them. Uh, what else is going on this uh, weekend? Hold on, talk about orchestra last night. Well, last night the 8th grade orchestra had a spectacular performance at MSVOA Orchestra Festival at Roseville Middle School. The orchestra played beautifully and had shown so much progress since their last performance. They, re they received a first division rating, the highest rating possible from their three judges. They were excellent team players and represented Baker with class. Well done. Way to go, uh, string artists. Nice job, and nice job to uh, Mrs. X as well. All right, what's going on this weekend? We've got Science Olympiad, regionals. We have club volleyball starting next week, so sign up for that in room 110. And then we, um, anything else? Yeah. Oh, so next week we're having a late start on Wednesday. Late start next Wednesday, so be prepared for that. Hold on, we got another thing today. Today the band is going over to Roseville for MSB away. Good luck to the band. Good luck to the band and Dr. X as well. All right. Wait, uh, wait, wait. What? Isn't it Mr. Quinn's birthday on Sunday? Oh my God. I didn't remember. That. Is it? Shouldn't we sing him happy birthday? I don't know. Um, he's not here, so. Ready? Well, he'll see it in the back. Okay, he'll see it on the back of the video. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Mr. Quinn. Happy birthday to you. All right, I'm sure he would like that a lot. That, maybe that tear will even be in his eyes. Uh, thank you, thank you. Um, I guess that's it. Have a wonderful Friday. We will end with a cool segment made by Allie, one of our broadcast club members, about things you never hear at Vegas. So we'll finish with that. Have a great weekend, and we will see you Monday. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bathrooms are so clean. Oh. This pop shop candy is way too cheap. How are they going to make a profit? There is no gum at all in these carpets. Ah, I have some missing assignments. I should go do those instead of playing on my phone. Our lunch period should be shorter. Gosh, Wikipedia is not a reliable source for my paper. These hallways oh, aren't crowded at all. The Wi-Fi here is so great. Wi-Fi's awesome. I'm so glad to be here on this fine Monday morning. Oh my God! What happened? Somebody should have thought about putting cameras in here sooner. I'll convert this document to a PDF, just like my teacher asked.
Gosh, I really hope all this snow doesn't mean we have a snow day tomorrow. No, Miss Calm, don't postpone the test. I want to take it today. Everyone stop talking. Our teacher would like to teach.